Hi, I'm Kelly with the Side Sticks team. I'm going to show you how to resize the opening in your front or side opening cuffs. The procedure we'll be using involves working with a hot stove and boiling water, so please use extreme caution when working around hot surfaces and hot steam. So a few things you'll need. A pot deep enough to fit about three quarters of the cuff, a stove or a hot plate, a clock, watch, or a timer, and then, depending on if you're trying to enlarge or reduce the size of the opening, you'll need a piece of something to enlarge it or a belt or strap of some kind to reduce it. I'll demonstrate both. I've got a block of solid foam here, and then I've also got a Velcro strap that I made out of adhesive Velcro. Adhesive Velcro can be found at any hardware store, but it doesn't need to be Velcro. It can be string, rope, or a small belt, or anything you have lying around the house that can strap around the cuff and adjust to the size that you want. And lastly, you'll need time. You need to let the cuffs cool for about an hour with the resizing pieces attached, otherwise they won't remember their shape. So pick a time where you can be without your side sticks for about an hour. So the first step is to remove your cuff pads. Then fill your pot with water about three quarters full. Bring the water to a boil and then reduce the heat so it's simmering. And then, one at a time, take your side sticks and dip the cuff about three quarters in. But don't submerge the cuff post or the aluminum forearm piece. It's very important that you don't submerge the cuff post, otherwise the cuff post slot can shrink and the cuff hinging action will become very stiff. Hold the cuff in the water for one minute. After the minute is up, carefully remove it and then give it a shake to remove any water droplets. And then, either strap the cuff down if you're trying to reduce, or put your object in if you're trying to enlarge. Then repeat the process for your other side. And be careful when doing this because the cuff will be quite warm. Now leave them with the resizing pieces attached to cool for at least an hour or until they're cold to the touch. And after that, they should remember their shape. We've got more tutorials and information on our website. And if you've got any other questions or comments, you can always reach out to us by phone, email, or on social media.